what's up kingdom kings and queens welcome or welcome back to your girl's channel if you are new here and you want to access your keys to the kingdom go right ahead hit that subscribe button turn your post notification bell so you're notified whenever a powerful word is dropped you are right here to catch it and if you are already a royal family you already know what to do be seated in heavenly places with christ jesus okay guys so as you can already tell by the title of today's video we will be talking about waking up between the hours of 12 to 4 a.m so if you are interested in knowing why you will keep waking up at these hours keep on watching Are you waking up between the hours of 12 midnight to 4 a.m. in the morning? Uh, so as we know, it's the Lord Jesus that is in control of our being. It's the Lord Jesus that is in control of our existence. If we go to sleep, the alarm clock don't wake us up. The train that's passing don't wake us up. The bus, our noisy uh, siblings or parents loud noises construction workers none of these people wake us up none of these equipments wake us up apart from the lord jesus himself so if he doesn't choose to wake you up you will not be awake so once we go to sleep it's the lord jesus that wakes us up and it is said that when we go to sleep we are next to death so if the lord jesus doesn't wake us up there is no more us okay so i can guarantee you that if you are being awoken between the hours of 12 a.m to 4 a.m it's the lord that is waking you up to communicate something to you whether he is telling you to get up and pray warfare prayers or he is telling you that you need to press in his presence so that you can access the angelics the spiritual realm okay right so when you are awakened from your sleep if you are being waken up at these hours uh at especially if you are awoken up at 12 midnight those hours are known as devil hours which is warfare hours so when if you are being awoken up out of your sleep by the lord jesus at 12 midnight it is time to go to war honey it's time to go to war you you need to get in warfare prayers prophetic persons people that operate in the prophetics they are usually awaken um out of their sleep at that hour to go into warfare prayers prophetic intercessors seers you know prof prophets they, whenever they are awakened at that hour it's to go into warfare prayers to tear down some things to pull down some things that the enemy has set up that the enemy has a sword in the realms of the spirit if you are being uh, awakened between the hours of 2 a.m to 3 a.m you know that that those hours are the hours in which there is a very thin line between the physical and the spiritual realm so it is very easy for persons to access the realms of the spirit it's very easy for uh people to gain access so there is not a lot of persons moving around there is not a lot of uh radiation going on so you know it is it is quite easy for people to access they are they're, they're more in tune they're more calm and everything for them to access those realms and also we we know that in that time between the, the hours of 2 a.m. and 3 a.m. are the hours where you can access the angelic realm. You can access um, the heavenlies freely. You can access these uh, realms, these domains, these dimensions freely. Because there's, there's, there's a crossing over happening at this hour. Also, 
these hours are where exchanges in the spirit happen so you know that also there 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 can be demonic exchanges spiritual exchanges so exchanges from the spiritual realm and the natural realm happens at these hours of the night so we are being awakened the lord is uh, waking us up to speak to us to enlighten us to show us these things to equip us and give us knowledge about how to operate in these hours, being strategic in these hours in our praying and how we go about praying at these hours, how we go about our day. So he wakes us up at this hour so we can take charge, <clears throat> so we can take charge of our day, know what to look forward to, what to do, how this is going to be set up and all that stuff and he also exposes the transaction that the enemy makes in these hours he exposes the the movements of the enemy in these hours to his his, his prophets his seers his uh, prophetic intercessors the people that he will wake up at these times so if you are being awakened out of your sleep at these hours do not go back to sleep do not force yourself to go back to sleep. Wake up. The Lord wants to communicate something to you. He wants to speak to you. He wants to show you something. He wants to give you access to the realms so you can understand how to operate. So if you are being awakened out of your sleep at these hours, I beg, do not go back to sleep. If you're awakened out of your sleep at 12 midnight, get to warfare, get to praying because it is a warfare hour at that hour. And if you are awakened at 2 a.m., 3 a.m., 4 a.m., possibly 5 a.m., the Lord wants to communicate something to you and give you access to the angelics, give you access to different dimensions freely because there's an exchange happening. There's a, there's a, uh, deposit depositing across from the two realms happening at those hours so if you are being awakened out of your sleep again at these hours it is definitely the lord jesus that is waking you up if you go to sleep as i said earlier you are next to death so it's only the lord that can wake you up no alarm clock no nothing if you get a dream and you're awakened out of your sleep from a bad dream from a good dream it's the lord that wakes you up because we know that when he can't uh speak to us physically while we're awake because we're too busy or we're moving too much we're not focused he will speak to us in dreams so when he wakes us up at those hours it is easy for him to communicate with us because when you are asleep you're next to death and immediately as you come out of your sleep your spirit is still open so he can speak to you so when you are awakened out of your sleep at those hours please do not go back to sleep uh get down in prayer communicate with the lord to see what he wants you to do and what he is trying to tell you what he's trying to communicate with you and in these hours if you continue to wake between the hours of 2 a.m to 5 a.m you will over time build up your gifting your prophetic gifting if you are operating in the prophetics you will um build up your prophetic gifting it will become stronger in exercising it in in using it you know so you will gain more knowledge about it you will gain knowledge of the realms you will gain knowledge of how to operate how to uh, deal with spiritual warfare how to deal with spirituality in general so if you are being awakened out of your sleep in these hours is the lord that is awakening you to equip you and to train you in the spirit so yeah if you are being awakened out of your sleep at these hours do not go back to sleep but go before the lord so that he can deposit in you so that he can make you powerful because you are indeed remaining prayerful god bless you thank you so much for watching and i hope this helps someone to understand why they why they keep waking up at these hours may the lord bless you and i'll catch you in my next one bye